Hello students, welcome to Soroswa classes. For detailed information about our classes, you can visit our website that is www.soroswaclasses.com and for other queries and doubts, you can just call us or WhatsApp us at this number 9836-793076. You can even like our videos and subscribe our channel for more videos. Today we are discussing some questions on work power and energy and our first question is a uniform chain of length L and mass M is lying on a smooth table and one third of its length is hanging vertically down over the edges of the table. The length is L and mass is M and is lying on a smooth table and one third of its length is hanging vertically down over the edges of the table. If G is acceleration due to gravity the work required to pull the hanging part on the table is and here four options are option a that is mgl option b that is mgl by 3 option c that is mgl by 9 and option d that is mgl by 18 so let's proceed to the solution mass of hanging portion is given that one third of the mass so mass of the hanging portion is m by 3 that is one third and the center of mass and the center of mass is C and the distance that is H we can denote the distance as H is equals to L by 6 on the tabletop so therefore let us draw the figure at first now This portion is the hanging portion. We can even shade it and this is the midpoint that is C. Center of mass. This is H. H is equals to L by 6 and the mass is mass of this portion is m by 3 that is given in the question so now w is equals to m g h so putting the value of m and h we can rewrite this as m by 3 into g into l by 6 that is m g l by 18 so here option d that is m g l by 18 is the correct answer so if g acceleration G is the acceleration due to gravity, the work required to pull the hanging part onto the table is MGL by 18. Now our next question is a particle of mass 0.2 kg, the mass of the particle is 0.2 kg is moving in one dimension under a force that delivers a constant power that is 0.5 watt to the particle if the initial speed in meter per second inverse of the particle is zero the speed after five second is now let's proceed to the solution w 
is half m v square we know that work is half into m v square so p t we can rewrite w as p t that is equals to half m v square now from this we can write that v is equals to root over 2 p t by m so here putting the value of p t and m we can rewrite this as v is equals to root over 2 into 0 0.5 into 5 divided by 0 0.2 is equals to 5 meter per second so here the if the initial speed of the particle is zero the speed after five seconds is five meter per second now our next question is an ideal spring with spring constant k spring constant k is hung from the ceiling and a block of mass m mass of the block is m is attached to its lower end the mass is released with the spring initially unstretched then the maximum extension in the spring is now four options are option a that is 4 mg by k option b that is 2 mg by k option c that is mg by k and option d that is mg by 2k so at first let us draw the figure let us assume that this is the spring here is the block here is m this is x where velocity is zero your velocity is also zero and the constant is k so if x is the maximum extension of the spring from the conservation of mechanical energy the decrease in gravitational potential energy we can write it as decreased in gravitational gravitational potential energy potential energy is equals to increase in elastic potential energy increase in elastic potential energy so we can write it as mgx is equals to half k x square or we can rewrite this as x is equals to 2 mg by k so here the option B that is 2 mg by k is the correct answer so the maximum extension of the spring is 2 mg by k this is our answer